Previously on the Steve Saga. So, how are we going to fix all of this? Listen, I have an idea, and it's not gonna be something you want to hear, Alex. You're you're not gonna like it. I'm warning you. You uh, sure you want to hear it? I think we should go through with it. Okay, uh, Alex. Yeah. I think things are gonna get a lot worse here, and I think I now have a good idea as to what the Guardian meant by we are making things a lot worse. Villains aren't always so obviously cut and dry. Sometimes, it isn't simply just an evil-looking monster that hates all things good deep down to the bone. Things can be complicated. All the more reason for me to find my friends. That's right. The gang's getting back together. Cause, well... This... This is the Steve Saga. I'm not sure if everything we've been doing has made any progress, Alex. We've definitely just been making it worse, and now I'm worried that we're not going to be able to save Time Steve at all. Um, would turning the machine off do something? I don't, I don't know how they really work. If we turn the machine off, then the infection's just going to spread completely, and now that the infection's accelerated even more, I worry that if we turn this machine off, then, well, I... I think there might be a chance that we could be skipping years, not just hours. Oh. Yeah. Uh, okay. So um. that's that's probably a no-go. And if we keep it on, well, then this lightning's just going to keep happening. And, well, Time Steve's already worse. And I have no idea what's happening with your powers now. He's, well, he's had a lot go through him. I mean, he tried to, well, he didn't try, seeing as he didn't even know what was happening. The powers went completely through him, and it didn't even go to you at all, right? When you were in the machine... Could you feel it at all? I didn't really feel anything, no. Great. Well, then if you didn't feel anything, Time Steve basically took the full force of all of it. I'm not too sure if he's going to be able to handle all of this too well. I'm not, I'm not sure what's going to happen with your powers. If we leave them here too, then... Well, maybe it'll be okay for now, but I I'm going to be real with you, Alex. I don't really know where to go from here. I mean, we... We don't have anyone else to look to! Not even the Guardian of the Spirit World wants to help us now! Is there any way to contact him? Maybe- maybe he could change his mind! Well, I know he's probably listening for us, but if he doesn't really like us at the moment, I highly doubt he'll show up. I, I can try. I can try and call for him. You think that it's worth a shot? I mean, do we have anything else to try? <sighs> No, we don't really have any other option. Okay, I'll try. Guardian? Hey! Guardian? Hello? Guardian, please? Look, maybe you were right. Maybe you had a point, okay? But we tried our way, and it was because we thought that there was no other way. I mean, uh, you have you have to understand that we're just trying our best out here. Please, please, tell me you're just... You're willing to help. Guardian? Hello? Hello? Alex? Yeah. I don't think the Guardian's willing to really even talk to us right now. I, I think he's pretty upset at us. Well, it's worth a shot, at least. I wish Galaxy Steve could be here. He always knows what to do. Well, at least he'll brighten the mood, right? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we're becoming too reliant on others, Alex. Look, I don't want to give up this fast. Maybe we can still do this, just you and I. We've gone through a lot worse, right? I mean, we took down Origin Steve. If we can do that, we can do anything, right? Well, yeah, but I can't really do much without my powers. You're right. You can't do much without your powers. Maybe it was a mistake trying to get Time Steve to siphon the infection out. Not only that, maybe there's a chance that since the infection did accelerate onto him, maybe he did hold on to most of it. There's a chance that your powers could be a lot more pure now. Maybe the only way in fixing this is to actually try and fully get your powers back. Yeah, the infection was accelerating, but now that you're aware that the infection was even there, maybe since you are, well, with your powers, the most powerful person here anyways, maybe you can do this. Maybe it is all up to you and me. If we can get you to have your powers back, we can fix all of this, but it's gonna be quite rushed. I mean, once you get your powers back, we're gonna have to be able to try and fix all of this before, well, Rainbow Steve? Is that... Is that you? Are you actually here again? Please don't run away from me this time. Saber? 
Rainbow Steve, you're actually here. Hi, Saber. You're you're actually talking to me? You can actually talk? Rainbow I Steve, I thought that I would never oh. see you again. I, I can't believe, I mean, you're obviously not talking with your voice. You clearly still don't have your voice back, but you're talking? Rainbow Steve, I can't believe it. You're not running from me this time. I, Alex, look, he's actually well, talking this time. S Saber, there's, yeah, there's nobody it's there. been quite a while. Yeah, it has been. I, <laughs> I'm so happy you're back. Maybe we can get a group going again. Alex, here, come on over here. I know you didn't remember uh, him, but now that he's actually talking, I mean, it's quite obvious that he's here. He's not running away or anything. You're starting to worry me, Saber. Why? Why? What do you mean? I look. If anything, this is hope. We have Rainbow Steve now. I don't know who that is. Well, I'll, here, let me, look, I know that your memory's probably a little fuzzy about it, but I don't know why it is. Either way, let me introduce you to him. Come on, come on down here. Uh, okay. Okay. Rainbow Steve, I don't think you really ever got a chance to meet Alex, but, well, this is a good friend of mine, Alex, and she, for some reason, doesn't remember all the stuff that I told her about you and, and all the stuff that happened with Galaxy Steve and uh, uh, us and all that, but Alex, this is Rainbow Steve. Come on, you gotta try and remember everything that I told you about him. He he used to be really good friends with Galaxy Steve and I. Saber, there's Look. no one here. What? There... You're doing it again. You're, you're talking to nothing. What are you talking about? I, Alex, he's, he's right here talking to me. He's... He spoke! I... It's just been you. At least that's all I've been hearing. Am I... Am I really missing something? I... I don't get it. Rainbow Steve, you are here, right? This is you, right? I mean, you... You're here in front of me. Of course it's me. So you are actually here then. I'm not losing my mind. I just need you to assure me that I'm not losing my mind right now because Alex thinks that I'm crazy and I'm... I probably look like a lunatic in front of her right now. Just... Saber, you're not losing your mind. Well, if you say so then. Alex, look, I need you to just trust me on this. The person that I'm talking to is someone standing right in front of me and for some reason you don't remember him, but he's actually talking to me. I don't suppose you know why, Rainbow Steve, do you? Or are you also just as confused as all of, well, with all of this happening? It's been pretty confusing. I actually don't know. Okay, well, look, Rainbow Steve, I'm sure you're probably a little scared as well, seeing as, well, I mean, she doesn't even know that you're here, but I can see you. Maybe it's the fact that I'm not stuck in this world, but I see you, so don't worry about it, okay? I'm here for you, Alex. Look, I hope you don't think that I'm completely losing my mind here, but I, I do see someone. And as a matter of fact, he might be our way of fixing all of this. Are you sure? It's, it's just someone that you're seeing. I can't see him still before Time Steve couldn't see him. Look, before I even met you, Rainbow Steve helped me get a lot, get out of a lot of problems, a lot of situations. I mean, he, he was there for me. Maybe he can help. Rainbow Steve, I don't think you even know what's happening. Let me run you down on what's happening, okay? Follow me. This machine area is, well, it's the only thing that's keeping Time Steve alive. You remember Time Steve, right? Time Steve also didn't remember who you were when I first saw you earlier. But this infection, there's been an infection going on and Steve's have been disappearing and it also affected Alex. Alex, well, before the infection took over, was probably the most powerful person in this world or, or ever. And since the infection got a hold of her, I had to get rid of her powers in order to stop the infection from spreading. So in here is a giant battery holding her powers and possibly the infection. And well, Time Steve, we had to put him in this machine to stop the infection from spreading to him as well, or it already got to him, but if it accelerated, he would be skipping time. And you know how he controls time. It, it's confusing, but it was weird. When the infection got to him, time was literally skipping for me. Hours would go by, days would go by, so I had to stop it. But now that he's in this machine, it's not gonna accelerate unless we let him back out. It's just, I don't know what to do. Alex doesn't have her power, so we can't go find Galaxy Steve, who's also outside of the timeline, and I don't know, Rainbow Steve, I don't suppose you know what to do, do you? I know it's a lot to put on your plate, but now that you're here, I just, I need someone's advice. Alex and I have been pretty lost. I might know what to do. <laughs> See, Alex, look, we might actually have a plan here. I mean, if Rainbow oh. Steve says that we have a plan, or if, if he knows what to do, then maybe we can actually figure all of this out. Alex, are you down to try something else? Uh, sure. Yeah, as, as long as you trust him, it, it's okay. Okay. Rainbow Steve, look, we tried before to try and siphon the infection through, well, well, get it to stop through Time Steve and get the powers to go back to Alex in this part of the machine. We were hoping that in, well, in turn, she would be able to get her powers back and then we could fix all of this. It didn't work though, and I think we only made Time Steve worse. I, 
I'm worried that things are getting a lot worse, and, and I just... If you think you actually know what to do, man, then that'll be a breath of fresh air because right now, everything's been going downhill lately. The guardian of the spirit world hates me now and I know that you've definitely met him because you've been in the spirit world and honestly, you're gonna have to tell me a lot about everything that happened there. But for now, we do have to fix all these things. I'll, I'll, we'll have time to catch up about even everything that happened with you later. So, Rainbow Steve? Um, Saber? Yeah, what's up? What's up? You just think of something? I don't trust Alex. What do you mean you don't trust Alex? She's super trustworthy. I mean, she's been by my side helping a ton. I, look, I know that you're worried, man, but trust me. If you trust me, I can vouch for her. I mean, she's been through a lot too, and she's been just trying to fix all this as well. I don't know why you wouldn't trust her, but I mean, you trust me, right? Look, I'm sure she is nice, but we can't have her here. Uh, Rainbow Steve, you don't get it. Alex is the only other person here that can even help us. She's just as worried. I mean, she probably thinks that I'm losing my mind and she's still believing in me. I mean, look, she probably thinks I'm just talking to myself right now. I don't even think she can hear what we're talking about, so don't worry about it, but Rainbow Steve, I, I, I gotta keep Alex around. She's, she's a good friend. She's a close friend. You wanna cure time, Steve, or not? Alex, um, can I, I'm, I'm, I'll be right back, okay? Um. Okay, I'll just stay here, I guess. Rainbow Steve, come here. I know you're worried, but now that you're here, you're gonna have to learn to work together with what we have and work with the people that we have, and those people are Time Steve and Alex. Alex may have lost her powers, but she's still just a valuable person, just as a valuable person as anyone else. She's she's kind, caring, and she works hard. She she genuinely wants to help. She can help. I want to help Time Steve, but I think we can we can get Alex's powers back. I mean, all of that power inside of that battery is hers. It, it's basically endless. It's dangerous. We need to figure out how to get it back in her so that she can actually use them for the betterment of everyone. I know that you don't trust her, but I, I can't just leave her. Look, we need to get rid of her now. She's extremely dangerous, and if you won't get rid of her, I will.